if we feel broken, we have a broken heart, it can lead you to understand who is Al-Jabbar. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, one of His attributes, and one of the meanings of the word Al-Jabbar is the one who mends. Allah can mend anything. If your heart, you feel that your heart is dead. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, one of the most beautiful ayat for me personally is the ayat in Surah Al-Hadid where Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala talks about أَلَمْ يَأْنِنِ الَّذِينَ آمَنُوا أَن تَخْشَعَ قُلُوبُهُمْ لِذِكْرِ اللَّهِ Has the time not come that the hearts of the believers should humble themselves to the remembrance of Allah? وَلَا يَكُونُ كَالَّذِينَ أُوتُوا الْكِتَابُ مِنْ قَبْلُ فَطَالَ عَلَيْهِمُ الْأَمَدُ فَقَسَتْ قُلُوبُهُمْ And that they not be like those who came before. And that book was given to them, but time went by and their hearts became hardened. And we, we see this ayah, and then we, we sometimes don't realize that the ayah that comes after is related to this ayah. The next ayah, if you look at it from a surface sort of way, you think that, you know, what does it have to do with this ayah? The next ayah talks about the dead land and how Allah gives life to the dead land. Well, what does that have to do with hearts? Allah's talking about the, the hardened heart, and then Allah's talking about the hardened land. And Allah is telling us that Allah is the one who gives life to the dead land. This is to tell us that the one who gives life to the dead land can also give life to the dead heart. And that even those people whose hearts have become hardened, Allah can bring those hearts back. Allah can bring life to the dead land. He can also bring life to the dead hearts.